The offenders were arrested for littering and dumping of refuse into gardens. Traders along choked gardens at Accra New Town were also summoned. This man repairing motorbikes along the street was also summoned. Sitting shop on the street, look at how he laid the carpet. Look at how he laid the carpet. And a fixing motor, motorbikes on it. No, we are closing it down. The assembly will take a decision. So it's a criminal offense, punishable by prosecution. The tax force locked up shops of offenders. But some of the residents and traders did not understand the reason for the summons. All the dirtiness come from top there. Even though if you come out it right now, when the rain fall, it will push the, the, the baller come to this side. See, the day they come and do this road, we are telling those people that they shouldn't lock this iron. This iron, because anytime we, we, come, we want to move, we want to push the gutter, we'll take the iron up so that we can get a chance to push the gutter. But they didn't listen to us. Friend fall from top. All this one will come from top and come and stop here. You can't go. Okay. Then what's our problem? But you're, you're supposed to help clean it. Clean it. We have been doing this several times. So do you mean so that I will be removing all this one, pay to Bolan with my, with my own account? Households without toilet facilities were also not spared. About 150. They were found culpable of sanitation offenses. So this is a signal to each and everyone that uh, Operation Clean of Frontage has come to stay. It's not going to be a nine day wonder. The ASIS forms part of the Operation Clean of Frontage launched by the Regional Coordinating Council.